The one football team have made it to Munich. Along with Volkswagen and the ID range, we're here for the European Championships to experience the football, the culture and everything in between. And speaking of the culture, we've actually already got one place that we need to be heading to. So let's jump in the Volkswagen ID4 and get going. Freedom. Schön, dass ihr da seid. Welcome to Adventure Bavaria. You are here to compete against each other in to make the perfect Britz. Before we start, I actually have a little surprise for you guys. So I would ask you to close your eyes, please. Okay. <laughs> no peeking. Okay. You may open them and look towards me. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> That's okay. what you guys gonna cook in today. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Matt, do you want to swap? Or oh, yeah, oh, this, this, this really brings out my eyes. Oh, oh no, I just broke this. Oh, Ta-da! What do you think? <laughs> the pretzel won't taste as nice if we don't wear this. <laughs> Uh, now that you're dressed and ready to go, I think we should start with the dough. Pressure is on. I'd say start, you guys. You don't see this on the daily news every day. Just yep, yep. Oh, We're good. There we go. Perfect. Feeling good about that. That was good. <laughs> I enjoyed that. So guys, are you ready to actually form the pretzel? Yes. Yeah. You need to take it and then just fold it. And then you're gonna roll out a little bit. Yeah, there you go. That's long enough. Then just put it back. Yeah, looks good. That is it? No? No, I've done a completely different shape. Okay, so now that you guys are Pritzen pros, we want to challenge your creativity and let you make your own individual Pritzens. Maybe, Matt, you can show us what you brought. I will start with this amazing Christmas smelling Biscoff paste and some coconut flakes on top. Obviously, when it comes to showing your personality, don't really think Matt's done that. So, me, Angelina, Italian name, Italian vibe. So, I have gone with perhaps mozzarella stuffed pretzel with some Parmesan cheese and a little bit of rosemary as well. So, you really think this cheese is going to work, huh? Who doesn't love dough stuffed with cheese? Now you're going to turn it. Yep. Yeah, that's double. Turn it. you done that? No, 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 you worry about what I've done. Oh. You stick to your cheese thing. <laughs> oh, I'm making such a mess. Way better. Oh, we... gosh. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> and then it's going to stick. Oh, wow, that looks amazing. So just a quick reminder, we're going to we're gonna judge them on your presentation, the taste, and the creativity. Looks, looks soft. Yeah. Looks, looks juicy. Delicious. I like that. What do you think? An eight? I think it's good. Let's have a taste test. It's very soft. It's very cheesy. I like the rosemary. I do have to admit, I think it's missing out on the parmesan. Right, yeah. I think it's missing out on the salt. Clearly a nine for me. It's a nine? For me, yeah. Okay. From the think, bottom of my heart. Yeah. Thank you guys so much. <laughs> <laughs> she took basically took Bavaria to Italy. I think creativity might it be a nine too. Yeah. Yeah? I've okay. lost this already. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that makes 26 points for your present. So let's move on. Matt, I think it looks a little rough. Seven for presentation. So Let's give it a taste test. I actually really oh, like that. that. <laughs> oh, look wow. at the smiles. Super it's crazy. surprisingly good. Yeah. I would give it a 10. Okay, so we've got the last one coming up. Angelina got 26, I'm on 17. Therefore, I need 10 to win outright, or nine to draw. I personally have to say that it's pretty creative. I think he earns a 10. Yeah, me, I think so. Yeah, Matt, I think we agree <laughs> on that, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so. it's 10 points for creativity. Yeah. Oh, crazy. which makes a winner, huh? No, well done. Um, 
yeah, that's all I've got to say right now. <laughs>